What thing would you tell someone about independent filmmaking? Someone who knows nothing about film production. No matter how much planning you're going to do, it's never going to work out the way that you planned it. I'm not saying don't plan. I'm saying that a plan is something that you forget and then you deal with whatever happens. Because uh, if you are trying to follow a plan, you will eventually fail. It just won't happen because there's always gonna be something, there's never gonna be enough time, there's never gonna be enough money, and if you let those things get in the way, then you won't be making anything. Keep like you did, like we did for Spooner, just go with the flow and have a really good time because you're there to have fun and just let it go and you're, you're making something awesome right now. Well, one thing would you tell someone about independent filmmaking, someone who knows nothing about film production, that you are seeing five to 10 to maybe 15 minutes of something that looked like it was fun to make that takes a tremendous amount of energy, a tremendous amount of time, sometimes money, sometimes not so much money, but that the devotion necessary to make the shortest little three minute film, four minute film, the belief in doing something important is perhaps something that not everyone understands who's not involved. <laughs> if you could have box office success or an Academy Award, which one would you choose and why? I want box office success just because I want more people to see my film. The Academy Award, that's great, whatever, man. You know, awards are cool and stuff, but we're in the business to entertain people. Now, I'm not, going, I'm, not, people. I'm not going to change what I'm going to do to appeal to people. I believe what I do is going to appeal to people, and even if it is in the independent style, in the independent spirit. There's nothing wrong with, you know, popcorn entertainment, but I think you can have a better layer of popcorn entertainment. You know, Jaws is better than Avengers Age of Ultron. And I'm not interested in making, you know, movies like Jaws, but I'm just saying, you know, there's a lot better acting, there's a lot better story, there's a lot better style. You can make a great film in uh, any style. I would Boom. like that as well. Because mm -hmm. you want you, you want that paper. I want, you want that, that bread. obviously. Want I that teach cabbage. And I play music and stuff. Yeah, it's like the way I feel about jazz. Poor jazz music. Oh, it's good music, but oh. it's like you like people think they have to be educated in order to uh, enjoy it, which it shouldn't have to be that way. This is all for everyone, you know. If you could work with any actor, who would it be and why? I listen to CDs in my car of music of people I know because it's my favorite music. If I could work with actors, they would be friends, local actors, who are professional actors, who are quite wonderful, who have devoted their lives. I don't know how many people know what a wealth of talent we have in the Capital District, and what a wealth of all kinds of talented actors, um, but also uh, equity actors, sag after actors, that there is a tremendous wealth of talent in this area, and they would be all my friends in the area.